Def Cool Dre no brain in industry, the things about the entertainment industry. You might not know, but I'm going to get you hip. So look, man, if you're not hip, you got to be hip already. But basically, two or, two or three, I think it was three of Diddy houses all got raided at once. I made a, I had it on live. Go check my live list and you'll see what they were talking about. But anyway, this is somebody that's driving by at the scene of one of Diddy's houses. And they're claiming to be his neighbor. And they're saying that they've seen him doing all types of stuff, bringing a certain age group of people to his house but let's just go ahead and play this yeah tell him stop bringing all the miners over here late at night i live right next to him he do too much he be like he be like buses like big ass buses you just see all type of shit hop out especially at night time like around three o'clock in the morning it really gets wild you know i'm his neighbor when my basketball go over there i just let it be because i don't want to knock on the door Man, hold on, let me see I live right next to him. He do too much. Yeah, you know, okay. I'm not laughing at what he's saying. I'm laughing at the comment section, bro. Like my mother, like that 2007 Bentley nigga ain't no neighbor. <laughs> Yo, like the comment section is crazy. I go I, I, now. I don't know what year Bentley this is, but anyway, back to the point. <sighs> I mean, it's not confirmed that this man is his neighbor. You know what I'm saying? It's not confirmed that this person is his neighbor. Nobody knows who this person is 100%. I ain't seen nothing saying that this was his neighbor besides this one post. You know, he could be trolling. He could just be trolling. Or he, you know, but I don't know. Why, do I, why am I getting so many messages, man? Jesus Christ, my Instagram going up on a Tuesday. Reference to a song. But anyway, back to the point, man. God damn. Diddy been going through it, son. He is going through it. Like, like you know, your man was on a, on a plane. They said they, they got a, they got the picture. This is the picture of his jet landing in Argentina, you know, Antigua. Antigua, you know. They said that your man jumped on a plane. He could have been tipped off. Who knows? But they did Raiders and all at the same time. And you even got this clip right here, which says it is Diddy outside of an airport in Miami pacing around. Like. Nah, man, I know I know I had I know I had audio. Audio version of that. Matter of fact, it's on it's on my YouTube. I'll just play it on my YouTube. Let me see. Give the internet a second because this place don't got the greatest Wi-Fi. But while we waiting on this to load up, subscribe to my channel real quick. I'd appreciate it. Come on, man. What, 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 what are y'all doing? Subscribe to the channel, but it's, it's taking too long. More of the story. This person right here, they were just recording him walking around like this. I mean, they were saying, they were saying like, oh, damn, I can't remember. I can't remember what they were saying. I'm not going to lie. But more of the story. Your man's going through it, bruh. And it all comes down to, do, what do y'all think? Like, do, do y'all believe that all these accusations... It's true. You know what I'm saying? Because it's hard, man. It's hard because it's like part of me wants to say, well, it's Diddy. The likelihood that it did happen is high. But I I refuse to just be like, Whew. I refuse to just be like, yeah, he did it. Because at the end of the day, I don't 100% know. Who am I to sit here and say he did it because of accusations? You know what I'm saying? Like I can't concrete say did he did anything because I don't know him to have done anything for a fact. We haven't got any evidence that concrete says that he's done anything. So with that being said, I refuse to just go flat flat out and say he did something. Very certain did he prone properties part of a sex trafficking probe. Give me a second, man. I want to. I want to play that video I was just talking about. 
just because it has the audio, even though it doesn't really add to it. It's just my OCD of wanting to play it has already kicked in, and now I don't want to do nothing else but play it. So we're going to play this jank. Come on, man. Shorts, shorts, shorts. Here it is. I guess you wonder what's going to happen next, Diddy. I know. Like I was saying, until I see some concrete evidence that says that Diddy did anything, I'm not going to just be like, oh, yeah, he did it. I'm not just going to believe what motherfuckers are saying because of accusations, bro. Because as somebody, as I'm a, cons I'm a consider myself a victim, as a victim of false allegations being brought forth upon you, because I've been through that shit so many times, bro, like too many times for my comfort from... People that's like I can't it's, it's not a lot of times But Two times is enough Three times is enough People that even close to me Women Like a girl that was very close to me Even tried to Like do that bro Like People will bring up Any type of allegation To try to tear your character down And I know people will lie Like the thing that people won't lie And the thing that people won't jump on a bandwagon To also lie on your name Especially when you're a prominent figure like Diddy Is ignorance But like I said, I ain't saying bro innocent. I ain't saying he ain't do none of I'm not saying that he that he didn't do the shit that people are accusing him of. It's just what I'm saying is until it's proven that he did something, I'm not jumping on the bandwagon. You know, cause accusations, man, it, it, it gets to you, bro. Like it can really fuck you over. Like just like this this other YouTuber right here or, or some type of social media person right here. I don't know, bro. He's fighting allegations and end up crying on the phone with his dad talking about it. Go watch that video right here. Hit the subscribe bubble right here, man. And I am out. You go somewhere.